gentlemen, we're off to Chain Lake again. We were flying on a few other different lakes, but because of the mild weather um, and some reports of uh, ice thickness, we decided, okay, we'll go to Chain Lake because we know it's pretty good. So let's go we're off. Yep, we'll go see if we can get a few more trout. And uh, it is an absolutely gorgeous day outside. It is. Like there's three clouds, the sunshine was, the sunrise was gorgeous. Nice thing about going ice fishing is you get to go outside early and see the sunrise as you're driving. So it was really, really orange there for a while. Uh, we should have a great day out on the ice. See you there. Sunny, no wind, like nothing. We go all the way down to the end to see what's going on. We'll go one, one, one ten, two. I see so far. Just two people out there. Yeah, yeah, it's kind of in the spot we want it to be. Yeah. But that's okay, we can go over a bit. I can't blame them. It's a nice spot. <laughs> Let's come on. Can't lift that. Too heavy. See, right? Okay. It's a sunny day. Quite a few people there. You want to go straight out that way? Out that way? Oh, sorry. Got my super cleats on because the snow has all melted. <laughs> the sled's going to get ahead of us. So you just let it get ahead of you. And you steer.
So we have 22 feet, 22.3 feet, and we have a solid nine inches of ice. It's getting a little bit thicker, slowly but surely. Although the other day it got. Here comes the tent. Ooh, more people are showing up. One, two, three, four trucks just pulled in. Yep. Our show is going to get busy. Great way to start a new year. Electronics, got our bait, little table. Now I'm going to set up the lines so that we can get out there and go fishing. As we're setting up, I'm marking fish down there lots. Got to hurry up and get my line together. Ooh. Set up two lines. Yeah, I'm going to. I'm just I'm going to have to Okay, that's it. A bunch coming towards mine. And then our first one of the day is a beautiful rainbow. Just like that. And then it's all. Oh, that's probably going to be falling to the hole. And then it was swallowed. It's right on the lip. And then, nice little squirmy rainbow. I'm good in the mouth. Okay, let's get them all. Poor Sullivan. Come on, you. Oh, yeah, another nice, nice keeper, real sized rainbow trip. Oh, yeah. Good, nice one. You doing the same thing, Andy? We got, we got one. He's trying to swim yeah. away, but uh, I'm going to pull mine up so we don't get tangled. Oh. Okay, and then he's just slowly, just slowly, he's under the ice. Yeah, no, he's right there, he's right there. Did you get tangled on that again? Dang. Oh, oh no, I see him. It uh, looks like it's a sucker. Oh, shucks, yeah, nice big sucker. Yeah, a Nice, nice, a healthy, nice big sucker. But...
being a busy day, it's beautiful. Like we were just right down there where you see a bit of snow. That was the ice from our holes. A lot more people showed up. Can't blame them. It's an absolutely gorgeous day. And now we are heading home. Goodbye, Chain Lakes. So this is where we store all our stuff. Our tent goes in there, our sled and stuff in there, the heater, rods, all that other stuff, bucket full of fish. And this we don't use anymore. No, but we have it just in case, right? But we gotta put her away. Yeah. There we go. And that's that, and all the electronics go on the back seat. You to go down there? Yeah, why not? Go take a spin. Day. A lot of people have the day off. Yeah. Well, we leaving early because we caught our fish that were allowed. Yep. Another nice day out of meal. Yeah. And then I cook them all up, and then we make like tuna salad out of it for sandwiches. Yeah. Good for a while. Yeah. Look how many people are out there. It's almost like a summer's day. Almost as busy as a summer's day. Now they park right on the ice here. Or right up to the ice. <coughs> yeah, right onto the edge of the ice there. Nice. So this is Chain Lake. Chain Lake Reservoir. Yep. Jane Lake Reservoir has a nice big boat launch. Has bathrooms, but they are not all yeah, have nice uh, camping grounds here. Power. Oh, yeah. Camping here is great in the summertime. Yeah. Yeah. You're not, you have no fire pits because it's all grasslands. But when it's really hot, you don't really miss the fire. Especially when you have a nice lake to fish in just you know, down the hill. People swim in it. <coughs> oh, absolutely. I've, uh, I've dunked in it many a time. Hot summer. Can't, not catching many fish, pretend to slip on a rock. <laughs> Oops, well, I'm in now. <laughs> but a lot of people come here and float around on the tubes and paddle boards. They have a beautiful little park here, playground for kids. It's a very kid friendly park. Um, an hour and a half. Concession but... stand in the summertime. I don't know if it's open now. Might be close for the season. Close for the season. <coughs> But uh, yeah, nice big lake, very popular. The ice was a good, oh, nine, ten inches, nine inches at least, minimum. I it was uh, eight, nine. No, it was nine. I, I measured it with the scooper there. Um, in, the, in the nine inch range. Um, cracking because it's getting nice and warm so you, you know you don't be afraid when you you're sitting there and you, you hear a crack go by it's the first times are a little scary um, but uh, no that is normal yeah. especially a nice beautiful sunny day it warms things up it is you, you wouldn't think it's the first of January 2024 um, it's it feels like October <laughs> Well, see you all in the next one. Have a safe drive home.